Well, I've just been handed the keys to the XC40 Recharge, thanks to Volvo Cars Australia. Um, and this little family SUV is a bit of a sleeper. It's got a 300 kilowatt motor with 660 newton meters, zero to 100 in less than five seconds. Um, a 78 kilowatt hour battery. Um, that's good for a WLTP range of around 420 uh, kilometers, according to Volvo. Um, it's actually a good looking thing. I didn't like the look of this when it first came out, but in electric form it's it's pretty sharp. There is an update coming for the 2023 model year. Uh, this car is actually currently sold out in Australia and all customer orders will actually get the updated model which will be MY23. On the inside there are a lot of similarities to the Polestar 2. It's just a slightly older interface, um, but it does use Google's Android Automotive Operating System. Lots of nice materials here. This one does have leather, but the 23 model year vehicles will have a, uh, a leather leatherette seating. Um, nice touch surfaces along the doors here. Ambient lighting. There's also nice flocking along the door trims. While it's a compact body, there's still room for uh, two adults in the back. And a reasonably sized rear hatch as well. Complete with uh, groceries. So yeah, 420 kilometre range, 76,990. I don't think I mentioned, uh, plus on roads in Australia. So this is a pretty competitive vehicle that I think, uh, according to Volvo at least, has a lot of demand. And I think it's going to be pretty popular amongst those looking at things like the Polestar 2, Tesla Model 3 and uh, Mercedes uh, EQA. Stay tuned to evbrief.com and our YouTube channel for more information and reviews on this car. See you soon.